Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Yeah. Yeah, if you didn't see the TikTok live yet, well, um, I'm making this video anyway, um, yeah, that guy who took my speaker, I just confronted him, basically, like, I, all I said, did was go up to him, say, hey, pay me back f uh, for the speaker, or give me the speaker back. Because I got proof you s stole it. And then he goes, I didn't steal it. And then just jumps right on me and tackles me down. But th thankfully, I was expecting that kind of thing. So I kept gloves on to keep blood from getting on his blood. Because I don't know what he has, you know. I was kind of expecting that reaction, you know, from the start. And luckily, I had this thing here in my pocket. The flashlight someone gave me. I kind of expected that reaction when I confronted him. And then he just tackled me to the ground when I, as soon as I said it. He goes, I didn't do it. It was your friend, Moon54. Yeah, except he was with me the entire time. We, he we he went first and the speaker was still on the table we came down here for 30 seconds and when we came back up it was gone that's proof right there and, he, he, and he's trying to he's trying to blame it on my friend moon 54 oh my god man like when one idiot like this guy has no brain cells in his brain whatsoever dona And look at my last streams for his hangout areas in Bathurst, New Brunswick. It's in the description, and I and I say it too on stream. I mean, they're not place is it's not his address. It's just pl hangout areas. And then I named the street that you could possibly be staying at. I don't know, but my buddy Moon 54 thinks I think he stays somewhere on Massive Drive. So he's somewhere. He's he, he, with more than likely. I would check that area. <laughs> Well, I don't encourage anyone to, I mean, like, just don't, don't, don't cause violence. I do not condone any tax, like, this is my situation, you know? So, but, yeah, I just wanted them to get some, like, maybe verbal harassment or something. That's fine, just don't physically assault, you know? It just makes it look bad on me. I don't condone harassment or anything. But, I'm documenting my life, basically. And, I didn't, and there's no pic, picture of him. Like, I didn't put any pictures of him or nothing. I didn't even put his, I just put his first name. That's about it. And did a description. Oh, wait a second, and um, we'll be about right back. I gotta let the kitten upstairs. Yeah, I think um, my little sister Alexis wasn't around when that happened. I'm so glad that at least she didn't yeah, see it at all. She was just getting off the school bus. So, that's a good thing, anyway. Yeah, and he smashed her TV, too. I didn't... He didn't tackle me anywhere on the TV. He just decided to go... Poof, right on the screen. Destroy my mom's TV. And that's the way you get paid back.
those people. Wasn't planning on, I was just planning on a verbal, uh, con, I was just planning on confronting him verbally. And then if he didn't give it up, I was going to make a video about it, but then he just tackled me to the ground. And I was, luckily I was prepared for that, because like, I don't know what it is about me. I have these feelings like when something's happened. Like, my thumb feels like it's broken right now. And you can see... Oh, it's it's not too bad, actually. Yeah. He was trying everything. Clawing at me, everything, man. But, hell, man. Self-defense. You jump on me, you know? All I did was verbally confront him and immediately jump right on me. And then after the whole fight, he, he decides to go wham at my mom's TV and break it. This guy, Dona, he, he, he shops at Shoppers Drug Mart. So, Shoppers um, Drug Mart in Bathurst, New Brunswick. Please watch. It, watch out for Dona. He sh he's banned from every store pretty much for shoplifting. So definitely keep an eye on him. For sure, he's banned from pretty much. He's banned from Foodland, Superstore, Sobeys. Um. Yeah, that's about all the grocery stores. The only place he isn't banned from is Shoppers. Or Burger King because it's impossible to shoplift there. He's banned from Canadian Dollar Store, Dollarama, Superstore. He's banned from Sobeys. I'm surprised. I think they just didn't charge him because he's old. I don't know why they didn't charge him. They should charge him. Good. Can't believe he did that to that many stores and everything. Maybe he did get charged for one of them, one or two of them. I don't know, but, but he's banned from, like, the only store he can go to is Shoppers, literally. Only store he can go to is Shoppers Drug Mart. So the Shoppers Drug Mart, keep a big eye out on, on Dona because I've heard from people that he's... He is shoplifting from that store. So keep an eye out. I never saw him myself. But I heard some people tell me um, that uh, the, they seen him like, like going around looking and basically grabbing things and then just walking out with nothing. Kind of thing. But... This is an anonymous tip because this guy, Moon54, is he's one of my... But he saw it. So Shoppers Drug Mart, really keep a big eye on Dona. He's, he's banned from every single store in the whole entire... In the whole entire town. Shoppers, you're the only one that he... Only place he isn't banned from. But he actually might be banned from there now. That's the only store I know that he isn't banned from. But every other store he's banned from. Yeah, these people are pieces of scum. They they would rob a little kid. They would sell a little kid for their habit. That's how bad they are. They're just terrible people. Well, at least this guy, anyway. I mean, I'm good reading. Not, no, not all like friggin' addicts or recovering addicts are bad, but, but um, they just like just some that just literally seem like they got no soul, you know. Oh. What a crazy day. My thumb's probably broken. So. Yeah. I'm going to end off this video here. Shoppers Drug Mart. Keep an eye out for Donai. Because he shoplifts all the time. He's banned from pretty much every store but yours. And maybe a 24 hour convenience store. Because it's impossible to shoplift there. But, but that's about it. 
that's the only place he's allowed. So Sharper's Drug Mart and Bathroom's New Brunswick keep a close eye on him. Because I've heard he has been shoplifting from there. I don't know. I never saw it because I don't want to stay as far away from that guy as possible. And that, he, and that, you know what? Like, you can't, can't always avoid him. So anyway, uh, guys and gals, hopefully uh, you enjoyed the video. Well, I, I didn't really, I just had to make an update, but, and explain the situation and everything. So, yeah, anyway, um, follow me on Twitter, uh, at D'Angelo John 1, um, TikTok, at D'Angelo Pitcher 420, and, and, uh, there's a cameo affiliate link below too, where if you feel like uh, getting like some cameo for if you're a YouTuber, get like you like Jesus is twenty dollars, not real Jesus, YouTuber Jesus. He's only twenty dollars or something. So, like, if you want to support the channel and make a right good video, getting uh, Jesus in as in your video, like. <laughs> be a good idea and you could support the channel at the same time and if you feel like paying to, and if you feel like donating just direct and you don't care about cameo my the paypal donation button link is in the description so yep that's about it this is d'angelo picture and i am piecing out